Hey everyone and welcome back to another Dropified video training tutorial. In this video I'm going to show you how you can edit in bulk all of your products in your Shopify store that's connected through Dropified. So let's get started. So once we log into the Dropify dashboard we can go down to our products. Now we can go to save products and we can click on our Shopify store. Mine is called the biggest easy. And so here you can see all of the different products I have in my store. And then you can either individually check the ones you want, or you can just press select all. It doesn't really matter, it just depends on what you want to edit. Then we can go to this drop down menu at the top right here, and we can press edit. So anything that's selected here is going to be editable. So we press apply, and it's going to open up a new tab. Now this is going to bring you to our bulk editor for Shopify. So what we can do is, we can go in and individually edit all of the prices that we have. So if I want to change this variant, for instance, I can change this to $8, or I can change this to $23, $75, anything like that. Or, if you go up to the top right here, you have a few different options. Now you can change all the prices to $7 if you want or you can press plus seven to add an additional seven dollars or you can do minus seven to lower the price or you can even do seven percent to increase by percentages so what you can do is you can add and subtract based off percentages you can just set standard prices by inserting a single price you have a lot of freedom to do that and this will also work in the compare at price. So if I want to do everything is compared at $90, everything will be compared at $90. Or I can do the compared price at plus $10 or minus $10. Or I can do the plus 90%. And so you can really edit all of these products very, very quickly and then that way you're not spending a ton of time individually setting prices for every single variant and product that you have. This is a great tool that's gonna to save you a bunch of time. And the last thing I wanna show you is the specific granular price changing tool that we have in our settings. So that way you can set different price changes at different criteria when you import products. Let me show you what I mean by that. So if we go into the left-hand menu and go to our settings, we get to our default settings. So right here you can do the automatic price markup, which is going to do this by default. Every product that you import is gonna be marked up by the number in here. Now 100% is a pretty extreme example, but say that something is imported at $2, it's gonna mark it up to four. Now if I wanna sell it for more than that, I can go down to this tool called Advanced Markup Rules, and I can click that. And here you can set min and maximum prices. So let me delete this one start from scratch, I can go to add new rule. So here I can set minimum and maximum prices. So right now I'm importing something at $2. So the minimum and maximum price that's going to fit this criteria is going to be applied here. So we can mark it up by a specific amount. We can either increase by a percentage or an amount or we can set it to a fixed price. Now if I want to make $8 on this, I can increase it by $8 or if I know that I just want to sell something for $10, I can set it to a fixed amount. So if something comes in at $2, we're gonna set it to a fixed amount of 10 and change it so that we are comparing it at 15 or something like that. So this allows you to get a lot more granular with all of the products that you import so that way you can really start making the specific amount of profit that you want on each of the products and you can mark them up in very specific ways based on the prices instead of just blanketing over them with a single markup rule. So once you're done with that, you just press save. And as you can see, it's listed right here and you can always go back and edit it or delete it. But that's pretty much all I have to show you in this video. Thank you so much for watching. If you like the video, be sure to leave a like on it. If you have any questions or comments or just wanna request a different video that we can cover in the future, be sure to leave it in the comments down below. And lastly, if you never want to miss one of our videos because you find them helpful, be sure to press subscribe and then hit the bell icon to make sure you never miss an upload. Until next time, I've been Riley with Dropified. Thank you so much for watching and have a great rest of your day.